Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right into episode two of A Girl and Her Guard Dog. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. I literally just had to go and make sure we were, I wasn't rewatching episode one. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, but not who you think. <laughs> That's so old, baby. Sorry, you're like clearly stalking. What the heck is going to happen in this episode? <clears throat> they really just put that in there! <laughs> Yo! Stop it! Oh my god! Because <laughs> the backlash!
can't really remember the ruined name. Why do you want to date him? <laughs> yeah, they're just friends. Uh, mm. huh? Aww. Yeah, Instagram. I don't really have any. <laughs> oh my god! Oh no, I hope so. I mean, damn, let her have. Bye, friend, my boy. Jesus, find someone your age. Yeah, I haven't posted since what? Two, three weeks ago? Yeah, what do you like to eat? You're right, yes. So, you know, if you want, you take a chance on them. I mean, he was cute. Like, I think if I was in high school at this time and seeing a guy like him, I would definitely try. Not someone like Kay, though, like <laughs> me now, because we around the same age group. Yes! Yeah. Music, damn. Mm -mm. Oh my god. Uh, wait, no, no.
Oh, look at Dee! Baby gotta go on her first day! Yay! <laughs> oh my god! At least he held her when she fell. Jesus. And he broke her fall. I feel nothing. How long y'all two gonna lay down there? Says you. Well, God, you just have the freaking list. I mean, you know, I kind of want to keep that list for myself, though. You know, definitely have to have that. But yeah, I agree. Did you get your phone though? <laughs> sneak, sneak, sneak. <laughs> you got this. Make sure he doesn't have like an apple tag or anything on you. Besides, I don't even think Kaya needs an apple tag or anything. He just knows where she is. And be a little mindful. Cause something tells me you're gonna be looking on that Instagram! <laughs> this episode's in and she's made like, what, six friends? Almost like now 11. And she deserves it.
He's gonna find out, and he's gonna be so pissed! <laughs> oh? Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> and that's why you don't fuck with him. Girl, uh, bro, he gonna kill him? He might go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he might want to go. Imagine if this was fucking in Yakuza lover. <gasps> Put me in. Put me in. Put me in. No, you're not stupid, sweetie. No, 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 no. You just didn't know. You didn't know what was going to happen. Like for me. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't. I'm sorry. <laughs> I love this man. I love this man so much. I need this man. Of course! <laughs> Apple tag! <laughs> I mean, still, that is stalkerish, but thank you for finding her because if he had done something to her, I would have been pissed. ちょっと。See, now I'm just, as I said, I'm imagining me in this. <laughs> Happy Grisha! Happy Grisha!
the character. AI is real. The girlies know what the fuck I'm talking about. Okay, once again, everybody, I gotta find it. It's in here. It's right here. Mm -hmm. Is this it? Is this it? It is. Just once again, just go read this book. Read the book. Read this. You can still watch this, but read this. Read this. Yes, it is everything. <laughs> everything and more. Just read it. Read it. So good. Okay, this episode was really better than episode one. It, it was interesting at first to see a guy, you know, come on to her, trying to be her friend, you know, being like, oh, hey, let's go hang out with some friends, da 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 let's do karaoke. And at first, you know, thinking he's just a regular cool guy who wasn't having any intentions. But of course, just like with any guy, of course, they have intentions. And so I think just like with her, myself, even watching it, I'm thinking like, oh, okay, nothing's going to happen and such. And that, you know, she's going to be okay. But once <laughs> the cigarettes and the freaking beer came in and literally everyone else is making out and he is like knocked out and he wakes up, I'm like, um, oh, we're doing that. Oh, I feel for her because poor Bratch's baby, like, Issa didn't have to, like, be in that situation. And it happens. It still happens even today. So, I mean, I'm glad he was definitely able to be there for her and to come in at the nick of time because the fact is, like, Kaya, and I feel like we're going to see that every single week regardless. Kaya's going to come in in the freaking nick of time and everything. How Kaya almost killed somebody today. It's a man. And we, we, we are not even talking about her anymore. We are talking about him. That's a man. A man. To come and get you when you're in a dangerous situation? Man. Hello. Like I said, once again, she is not in this show anymore. I am in this show. <laughs> this is not a high school student anymore. This is a 29-year-old with the 26-year-old and such. Because, <laughs> like, I cannot. But the character AI and everything that he is saying is so freaking real and to a T. That's something that character AI would say, and I cannot. And, like I said, it's worse because of the fact is of who he is voiced by. And I have a huge crush on his Sayu. Hell, tomorrow is Friday. Tomorrow is Goblin Slayer Season 2 day. And I get to hear him as Goblin Slayer. And your girl is so excited. <laughs> Happy dance. <laughs> like, oh my god. But this was, this was a lot better than Episode 1. I mean, Episode 1 was something. <laughs> and I gotta put this joke out there because they did that real quick with this epi second episode. The fact that they're putting that little note in this episode because of the backlash that this show got specifically from last week and such because a lot of people was really like in the coming weeks of this airing a lot of people were talking about this but officially when this started airing last Thursday um, I know at the time I was at work but because I was super busy, I wasn't coming home until about three o'clock in the afternoon. Plus, I was like extremely tired because I was working my ass off and such. Um, I was barely on Twitter. But when I did have time, I did see people talk about this. And more, like we said, more for the bad than the good. I think now this episode, uh, there was a lot of good in here, but still bad and such like i said of course when any moment that they have together even if it's something that is like completely wholesome and stuff and not being platonic where it's like yes they're going to be together and stuff 
I think, no, when it's platonic, I can kind of, like, feel something, especially if it's, like, I'm not imagining her, I'm imagining me. And, like I said, that's how I'm going to watch the rest of this damn series, too. Because, <laughs> bruh, but the fact that this man came into the day, <laughs> the hideout, shut up the place, and was pissed over the fact a boy was literally sending her DMs on Insta and wanting to be friends on Insta. Bruh, I cannot imagine, like, what she's gonna go through when she has to go to prom or any homecoming dance like this dude gonna have a fit <laughs> like seriously i can't he's looking hilarious <laughs> like but i get it because he wants to protect her I, I, truly it, it's the same thing with um the series with the little girl Latina and her dad and how her dad is super overprotective and stuff. And I get that, especially like even if you have a boyfriend or even a husband who is like that too. And, and it's cute and stuff. But at the same time, you want them to know that like, oh my God, I, I'm a bird. Let me fly. Let me, I gotta fly the coop sometime, babe. Like, yes, you can still be there for me and such. I thought it was a little, you know, mm, what's the, how do I word this? Well, I, I like the fact that he did have GPS to track her. Um, as I said, Apple CarPlay. I mean, uh, Apple AirTag and such. but Or any type of GPS. But at the same time, like, it is a little messed up. Because, of course, yes, for her safety and because of the fact is her grandfather is, you know, head Yakuza-ish like that. Yeah, like, anywhere she goes, he needs to know. Like, yes, that's very protecting and nurturing and such. But then when you also think about the dark side of that, you'd be like, mm Mm. yeah but other than that guys that is my reaction towards episode two of a girl and her guard dog if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel and make videos there so when i enjoy the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next thursday for episode three bye guys